Together we shall write the end to this wretched fairy tale. In ink, black as despair. Now, Reen, let us begin. Oh my god, you sick bastards. Alright guys, I'm going to say now, there is going to be a high potential for CS4 spoilers in this video, and if you don't want to see them, I would just back out immediately, just get out, okay? Because we're going to go deep into what has just been announced. So, a video outside of my normal schedule here guys, because I couldn't believe what I was seeing. I just finished work, I went onto Twitter, I saw this announcement, and it just caused my mind to go into overdrive. My mind right now is all over the place, it's still all over the place, and I'm literally like shaking as I'm recording this right now, so, you know, if I'm, if I'm, you know, kind of stuttering a little bit as I go through this, just know that it's because I'm very excited for what is potentially coming. So I will say now, sorry for the quality of this video, sorry that it's going to be rough, because, you know, I just had to get this out there. So as you can see, a Cold Steel 4 announcement was made by NISA, who looked to have retained the license for the game, which I'm sure we all expected. What we didn't expect is to get an announcement like this, even before the Cold Steel 3 Switch port of the game has been released. Now, needless to say, I'm buzzing, I'm shocked, and I'm still apprehensive, because look at the date. What day is it? Okay? And that is why I think NISA are so cheeky for doing this. But I'll tell you, if this is fake, my god, all I can say is, well played NISA for doing it, and I applaud your bravery. But the more I look into it, the more I read about it, I honestly do think it is straight up legit. The links when you follow them, they take you to the NA site for NISA to pre-order the title, to pre-order the collector's edition, and it's due for a full 2020 release for the PlayStation 4, and it's going to be followed soon after by a PC port and a Switch port in 2021, though I don't know how soon after that's going to be, if it's going to be in early 2021 or mid or late, who knows. I imagine it'll probably be early. Now, as for the Collector's Edition itself, it's called the Cold Steel 4 Frontline Edition. It includes a collector's box, an official soundtrack, a steelbook, the complete Black Records art book, seven art cards, and a cloth poster, though I'm not so sure on the size of it as of yet. I imagine it will be similar in size to the one we got in the East 8 Special Edition, which is pretty damn large. You guys probably would have seen it in some of my other videos. But there you go, guys. If we're not being trolled hard, Cold Steel 4 is coming to the West this year for PlayStation 4 and soon after for PC and Switch in 2021. Wow. And right after I just bought the Japanese version.